This here is an E-Tex City Laser Grip 1080 Infrared Thermometer. Goes to minus 58 F to 1022 degrees Fahrenheit. These particular ones aren't dependent on distance. This uses a single 9 volt battery, which is inside this. And get it out. Battery is included. See, so the information on it. Minus 58 to 1022. Accuracy plus or minus. 2 to 2% 2 or 2 degrees C. Distance to spot ratio 12 to 1. Response time 500 milliseconds. I got this off of Amazon. It's got three buttons light, laser, C and F for Fahrenheit and Celsius. In the US, we use the Imperial system, which is Fahrenheit. Everyone else uses Celsius, because you're all behind the times. Schematic. So let me put the battery in it, and let's see how she works. Okay, battery's installed. So right now it's 81.7. Now it just turned off. Turn this, press this light button here. I pull the trigger. Press the light button. Lights up so you can see it better in the dark. Press the laser button. You see the laser icon turns on. So this way when you pull the trigger, you see the little red laser. That's so you know what you're, what you're pointing at. So right now the wood is reading 82.6 degrees Fahrenheit. So let's shine it on the lamp here. This is a halogen. Well, not a true halogen, but like a halogen incandescent substitute. We're reading... About 134. Thirty. Yeah, about. If I can aim it steady. About 132, 133. The bulb itself. Let's see the temperature of the heater is. The heater's not on, but it's sitting right there in front of the furnace vent. 92. 95, 96, depending what you aim at. Carpet's 104. Because this is where the furnace vent, the air comes out of there from the furnace vent underneath here. So the air temperature there, the carpet's about 104. And now it's cooling down. Furnace probably just shut off. These aren't dependent on distance, so you know, like. You can hold it right up close, you'll get an accurate reading. You can hold it back, you'll get an accurate reading. It's compact, it's comfortable to hold. Automatically um, shuts off after a couple seconds. So this will switch between Fahrenheit and Celsius. You can turn you have the option of turning the laser on and off. So let's pull the trigger again. Green is 89.5. As so you press it there, you turn the laser off, but then you don't know what you're aiming at. So I'll turn it on again. The red laser dot is just so you know where it's, it's not the measurement itself. That's, that's to guide you so you know what you're aiming at so you can get an accurate reading. So you can turn the backlight off if you want. So, on a nice unit. It's lightweight. It's compact. 
really not much to demonstrate. Again, to change the battery in this, simply pop that open. There's your 9 volt battery. It takes any standard 9 volt battery. How long it lasts depends on how often you use it. But the battery it does come with a battery when you buy it. See, that's the laser end right there. That's your laser pointer, so you know what you're aiming at. And this is the actual sensor. So, this was the E Tech City Laser Grip 1080 infrared thermometer. Goes from minus 58 to 1022 degrees Fahrenheit. So, thank you for watching.